And new tonight, the Arkansas Symphony Orchestra is getting the chance to grow in ways they never have before, making sure students will have the greatest opportunity to learn and succeed in a new building. THV 11's Ashley Godwin shows us the plans for a long sought expansion. Children practicing their instruments, but as they grow in their music, the Arkansas Symphony Orchestra is outgrowing the space. And so we are just literally on top of each other. For the last 25 years, Arkansas Symphony Orchestra has used the building on the Catholic Diocese grounds for their offices. But the offices share space with the audition rooms, private lessons, and rehearsals for the youth orchestra, even converting a storage closet to allow more kids to learn. Nothing says, <laughs> nothing says, uh, how fast can I write this grant than listening to beginning violins. It's right here next to Heifer Village where the Arkansas Symphony Orchestra will have their community education building and they're one step closer to groundbreaking. We're so excited. So the Wingate Foundation has given us, has issued a challenge to us. They will, when we raise $3 million, they'll give us $1.5 million. The last bit of money left and the new building will have plenty of space with music classrooms, a music library, administrative wing, and the heart of it all, a rehearsal hall. The most beautiful part of the building is, is where our kids will be playing. So it's, we're calling it the Grand Hall. Um, so it'll be ceiling height so the kids can hear each other, but we'll be able to do recitals. Giving students the opportunity to grow into talented team players and leaders for the next generation. We need a new facility so that we can grow more students and grow more leaders and grow more doctors and IT and musicians and music teachers. In Little Rock, Ashley Godwin, THV 11 News. Thank you, Ashley. East Village, where that new building will be located, is not the only thing moving into that area. Lyon College will soon be moving some facilities into the Heifer building, and Fidel & Co. is looking to expand with a grocery store.